from the United States of America. Fighting men of the United Nations, here's mail call. Sent your way by special service. It's one big package of words and music and laughter delivered to you by the stars from whom you want to hear. And standing at the microphone on the sending end of this international sound letter is the man that's going to master the ceremonies for you. Your favorite star of radio, screeno, chico, and harpo, Groucho Marx. <laughs> Thank you, Don. That was a nice introduction, but a little unnecessary. Everybody here knows who I am. I know who I am. And you said you know who I am. You ought to know who I am. You ran away with my first wife. <laughs> uh, I'm satisfied. I'm glad that you kept running, too, huh? <laughs> Groucho, you leave me in a dither. I don't think you could get in a dither. <laughs> you know, Wilson, I just don't understand how a man can be so heavy on bottom and so light on top. <laughs> But let's get on with this. I'm in a hurry. I want to get over to the Derby. They have a new dish over there that I want to try. Oh, you mean the turkey wings with cream gravy? No, this is a blonde waitress at the second table. <laughs> now, fellas, if anybody is still listening, this is Groucho Marx broadcasting to you through the courtesy of some people around here who know you're powerless to prevent it. <laughs> Take your time. We're short anyhow in the script. You know? <laughs> But I can postpone it, if only for a little while, by introducing the outfit you've asked for more than once since their first appearance on Mail Call. Leo Diamond and the Harmon Airs. Thank you, Leo Diamond and the Harmonia. The Harmonias. You know, there's nothing I like better than a group of men singing together, preferably the same song. <laughs> and sometimes in the same key. Well, we couldn't get a group tonight, so we got one man who sounds like a group. This fellow is undoubtedly every bit as good a baritone as Donald Dixon. And on some nights, he's even better than Donald Dixon. In fact, he is Donald Dixon. <laughs> Gossip, it's a battle of Jericho, Jericho, Jericho. 
George fit the battle of Jericho, and the walls came a tumbling down. You may talk about the kings of Gideon, you may talk about the men of Paul. There's none like good old Joshua at the battle of Jericho. George fit the battle of Jericho, Jericho, Jericho. George fit the battle of Jericho, and the walls came a tumbling down. Up to the walls of Jericho. March with spear in hand. Go below that slam hole, Josh, with five calls of batteries in my hand. Night morning, Josh, it's the battle of Jericho, Jericho, Jericho. Ho, 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 Josh, it's the battle of Jericho, and the walls came tumbling down. Then the ram lamp, the horn began to blow, trumpets began to sound. Josh was commander, the people in town. And the walls came tumbling out. Dark morning, dark with the battle of Jericho, Jericho. Jericho, not amid the battle of Jericho, and the walls came tumbling Thank you, Donald Dixon. Well, fellas, that singing should have put you right in the mood. What it should have put you in the mood for, I don't know. I know what I'm in the mood for, but they didn't put me there. <laughs> Which brings us to the subject at hand, swing and its relation to American music. According to an old thesaurus I read while I'm shaving in the morning, <laughs> swing is the ultimate artistic expression of an instrumentalist through the medium of improvisation. Maybe I better shave that thesaurus in the morning. <laughs> Better yet, I'll shave this introduction a little and just say, here's the Chi-Chi girl herself, Rose Murphy, playing and singing, Cecilia. Does your mother know you are Cecilia? Does she know I'm about Cecilia? Thank you, Rose Murphy. 